insecticide that is great for basically strengthening up this area which is known as Japanese Cosmo Lift so all you have to do is take your two fingers like this Hi everyone welcome to my channel I am in my old setup after years I think last year I used to shoot in this setup so today I'm going to teach you like around this area the lower mouth area we're going to focus on this area trying to understand like why do you start seeing a lot of increase in the philtrum like many of you are commenting that your philtrum is increasing or if you are having you know drooping mouth or if you are having thinner lips because with age they tend to start becoming thinner so what are the exercises that you can do for all of these problems we're gonna do that step by step let's start so the very first thing is like whenever we talk about this lower power of our face and if you are feeling a lot of you know droopiness means your neck is having a lot of tension so what I love doing is so do like this kind of movement on your neck 15 to 20 times with one right hand look up and relieve the tension similarly with the other hand Now the first thing that you have to do is obviously apply facial oil, you can use any oil that you want to. I am applying squalene oil and that's totally fine your wish. Now what you have to do is tuck in the slip, look up and then massage your neck. Again, you will tuck in. Next, I'm going to teach you an acupressure point, like especially if you're feeling that your lips are thinning or you're having a lot of increase in the philtrum. So, what you have to do is like this and where your eyeball is here. Like, I'm watching in the monitor where I can see myself. So this place here, this is the point that I'm talking about. You have to massage this point from 30 seconds to one minute and it will help in relieving any of the pressure. It will help in increasing the blood circulation toward your lip area. You can do circular motions or you can, if you don't want to do anything, just keep this point pressed for 30 seconds. Next is if you are someone having a lot of lip lines around your mouth and for that what you can do is inside of your mouth you're going to rotate your tongue like this. Start from this corner and then try to trace around the mouth as I'm doing here. So repeat one clockwise five times and repeat anti-clockwise five times. So total it would be ten times. You can also do the lip plumping exercise if you are feeling that your lips are becoming super thin or so. So what you have to do is pucker your lips. So if you are having droopiness around your mouth and you are seeing a lot of marionette lines also so what you can do is take your two fingers like this because this muscle here starts becoming shorter and then you feel that pressure around this area so you have to stretch it by doing this.
so if you are someone feeling that your lips are uh, thinning and you need to do something specifically for your upper lip and all so what you can do is or if your filtrum is something that is becoming longer so what you can do is bring in inside your lip like this as i'm doing here inside your teeth like this and then you have to tap Don't worry, it will not elongate this area. In fact, it will renegotiate this area, bring in more blood supply. Tuck it in the lip and then tap. Another lip exercise that you can do for improving this area is So bring in your lips like this as I'm doing here and then you have to blow the kiss out. This is really amazing for toning this area. So this one you have to do 15 to 20 times then give a breather in between of five seconds and then repeat again like you have to do two sets of this 15 times each so Another exercise that is great for basically strengthening up this area which is known as Japanese Cosmo Lift. So all you have to do is take your two fingers like this up towards your ear, bring from your ear and bring down. Up from your ear, bring down. Up from your ear. Do this at least 10 times. Similarly on the side. Massage your ears, bring down everything, don't forget to massage these points here which are the acupressure points, this one. So these were the exercises that I wanted to share with you for lip area and the droopiness. If you still have any other questions do comment below. So if you want me to share facial exercises on any other thing, do comment below that also. Subscribe to my channel, like the video and I will see you in my next video. Take care. Bye.